Ladies and gentlemen, this welterweight bare knuckle bout is scheduled for five three-minute rounds and is brought to you by GC3. Our referee in charge when the bell rings, Andy Albrighton. Let's meet the fighters. First, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing the black trunks. He stands five feet, six inches tall. He weighed in at 149.9 pounds. He holds an even bare knuckle record of two victories versus two defeats. And he fights out of Weston, Mark, United Kingdom, by way of Mogino, Poland, introducing Marcin Psycho Kozjak. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, wearing the black trunks with white trim. He stands five feet, six inches tall. He weighed in at 149.9 pounds. He is a veteran of one bare knuckle bout, and he fights out of Cheltenham by way of Panjshir, Afghanistan, introducing Salim Panjshiri Jamshidi. Set to get this one underway. Sam Jam Sheedy, Marcin Kosiak. Here we go! I will say, as Mike that uh, Marcin said to me, he'll finish it in two rounds. There you go. Well, we'll see. Marcin's greatest influences, Nick and Nate Diaz. So I asked him, I go, you got the Stockton slap? I guess we'll find out soon. We'll find out. And you're the man with the Stockton slap. I, yes, indeed, I, may, I did. I, and Nick and Nate will give me credit for it. <laughs> Ooh, took two shots there, though, uh, Marcy. And I love what you alluded to and what we heard in the feature from Sam. I didn't deserve to win. I didn't put in the work against Joe Fitzpatrick. And when it really comes down to it, if you want to see the man responsible for getting better, just look in the mirror. You win or learn, you? you learn, yep, yep. Good open to this round. Welterweight matchup. I like his... Oh, caught him. I like his style, though. It's very similar to Jimmy Sweeney's style. We saw in the past that, that hand, that cobra-like stance that uh, yep. Sam has. He'd have his hand up, trying to get Marcin to look away. Working in the dirty boxing. Marcin, a lot of kickboxing on his resume, 2014 World Association of Kickboxing Organizations. He was the Vice English Champion. He's in the black trunks. Black with the white stripe is Jamshidi. Look at Marcin's face. I've seen all his fights. I've not seen him this focused. He's not took his eyes off. I think this is the first fight he believes he can win. There you go. And when we asked him about the Trigon, he said, less space, I love it. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. Final minute of round number one. He's tough as well, Sam. Yeah. Sam Jamshidi is a tough guy as well. He's only one fight and he's lost, but you can see this is from Afghanistan. Yes. Nothing's a problem to him in the ring, is it? This, this is a day off for him. Correct. Just a, both been tagged, and I think they're just keeping away at the moment. And, and we should point out that in BYB, three minute rounds. That's the big, big difference. BKB, two minute rounds, Tom. So you're right. They, they're thinking, okay, where's the bell? It's late. So many times I saw fighters almost winning it, and the bell saved the other one. The bell doesn't save you, you've got, you've got, to, you've got to be fit. You yes. cannot, that's why I called it a lie detector. You've not done the work, it'll come. What a fight. Ian Harry Gigliotti, round number two. Black with the stripe is Sam Jamshidi, Marcin Kusiak in the black trunks, swing and a miss. I think if I was the coach for Marcin, I'd just say, listen, you're, you're really tough, but keep your chin there. Yeah. Because he's, he's actually, without having a target painted on his face, he's inviting a punch, you know? Much like you have seen over your, your many years in this game, Tom, that's something the Magic Man, Pauli Molinaji, always talks about. You can't back up and get that chin up. Yeah, get absolutely. I need no. 
he would absolutely know. I do like Marcin, though, he's following him. Yes. He's actually hunting him down. Trying to cut off the trigon. That's exactly what he's doing. One minute into round number two. And he promised two rounds, and he finished it. Got 155 to stay true to his prediction. Remember BYB, you never know. You never know. A great exchange there. Heavy shots from Kosiak and from Sam Jamshidi. Great exchange. Marcin has made it easy for him because he kept the distance. Instead of getting in close, which was his success in the first round, he's kept a bit of distance now, and that suits Sam Jamshidi. He'll begin to pick him off. A lot of movement from the 24-year-old. See, he's just put his hands out saying, come on, he wants him to get in close. Born in Afghanistan, now living here in England, looking for his first win in his debut. Inside the oh, line, try got big shots. That was a push and slip, no eight count, but big shots coming forward from Jamshid. Now he's got him in the corner. Well, I thought he had, but <laughs> Jamshid went, no, I'm not having it, out he comes. 40 seconds, round number two. Thirty seconds. Marcin readily admits his technique's his biggest problem. He's got none. So what he wants to do, he wants to fight. Aggressive style brawler, pressure and anger. He described his fight style and strength style. Well, he's a front foot fighter, isn't he? That's all he knows. Come forward. Catches him with a body shot, then up top late in this round. And let's be fair. Two defeats, he needs a win. Yes. Marcin needs a win. Two minutes to three minutes. And you can see some guys so far, like Sam will take the first minute and just kind of set up things yes. and then go hard for the second two minutes. Harvey did the opposite. He never got to the second two minutes of round number two. He's a guy in a hurry. Yeah, yes. It's just, you can see Marcin just watches He's not, not really working off anything, he's looking to land that big right. He's desperate to land the big right. He wants to finish it, Marcin. He's already in overtime, by the way, he promised two rounds. Yes. Posiak is built for aggression. He said, I believe I will be a champion, and I don't want to be working in normal work anymore <laughs> but with that he needs a win well he's had a terrible life let's be fair yes. he's had he's had a, a, a lot of demons to deal with and this is his way out martial arts provides that for any great act 100 percent i think both fighters need to step this up Mike. Yeah. and maybe maybe we're at the stage where they've got to risk it for the biscuit we, we are at the exact midway point of this five-round fight. So, biscuit time it is. I'm going to learn many new cool phrases. Thank you. I'll invoice you direct. There you go. <laughs> Venmo. Punches <laughs> coming from... Looking for those openings. Jam Sheedy. Black with the strike on his trunks. Full black trunks for Koziak. Take down. No two points. He's breathing heavy, Koziak. Yes. Which will happen with an adjustment. And more time as we've talked about. 60 more seconds each round, but also... Sam's pulling him round the ring. Yes, yes. And taking him out of his clinch game. Correct. 
and it'll gas you out being on the defensive mode, the defensive side of the matchup. Jam Seed is just having to walk away. Yeah. And then Duck Luck is just pushing him around the ring. And Marcin's like looking at him saying, listen, stand and fight me. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Andy Albrighton calls a stop to this contest at the end of the third round, declaring your winner due to a corner retirement, Marcin Psycho Kozia. Congratulations to Marcin Koziak.